break in Montgomery County, police say a father opened fire on his four family members, killing his wife and son before turning the gun on himself. WJZ is live. George Solis with details of this chilling incident. George. Vic, police still piecing the details together of what they're calling a domestic related murder suicide tonight. Two of the victims still in the hospital fighting for their lives. Monday evening, a small amount of crime tape, just about the only trace of the harrowing scene that unfolded off Amber Lee Drive only hours earlier. That's right, uh, shot the wife and, and children. Montgomery County Police arriving just after midnight following reports that several people had been shot inside the home. What they found? A family of five suffering apparent gunshot wounds. This investigation is ongoing, but it appears that um, this is a domestic related. Uh, murder suicide. Authorities later revealing it was the father that did the shooting, a man identified as young Kim. Investigators say Kim shot his wife Sang Kim, his 10 year old son Andy, his 22 year old stepdaughter, and another one of his children police have yet to identify. His wife died at the scene, the 10 year old later dying at the hospital. Late Monday, police say that unidentified child and the 22 year old were still at a local hospital recovering. And you have five members of this family who were shot and three uh, killed. Uh, so, I mean, it, it's a tragic day in Montgomery County. People in this neighborhood who tell me they knew the family for several years say they are just devastated and having a hard time finding the words to describe this tragedy. Just knowing that it can happen to anyone in any family and you don't know what's going close behind closed doors is uh, frightening. A motive still unclear and now part of an ongoing investigation and what many say is an unsettling turn of events in this otherwise calm neighborhood. Now, police tell us they did respond to that home last year for an unrelated case, something involving a landlord dispute, something obviously nothing quite like this. Anyone with information about this case urged to contact police. Live tonight, George Solis reporting for WJZ.